hi guys welcome back to another video and if you're new here welcome my name is Sierra and in today's video I'm going to be doing a review on beauty forever hair um, before we jump into the video though I would just like to make a disclaimer to say this video is in partnership with beauty forever hair the Amazon company they did send me this hair um, for a review so thank you to be forever hair for collaborating with me on this video and we're gonna jump right into the video this hair is brazilian body wave with a 12 inch closer 14 16 and 18 inch bundles and i would just like to start off by saying that this hair is full as ever like i've never had a wig this full so i just like when i first got the bundles i was like um uh, i'm not sure if this is gonna look right and this to me i was like at first when i first um put finished making the wig um and put it on i was like what am i gonna do with all this hair like it looks you know like when you never seen yourself look a certain way you're just kind of shocked so to me, I was just a little shocked at how full the hair was, but then I grew to love it. I feel like it looks really, really good on me. So a little bit about this hair. I told you guys the length and everything of this hair. I did use all three bundles to make this wig. I have never used that many bundles to make a wig just because I was never, I wasn't like able to fit the the bundles onto the um onto the wig cap or whatever to fit my head this is what three bundles and a closure looks like not a frontal so i would say the first thing or the, the first or second thing that i noticed about the hair was that the the closure and the um what is that called the closure and the 18 inch bundles seem to have a looser curl pattern than the 14 and 16 inch bundles they had a different curl pattern i don't know why but when i put it all together it looks really really good and i don't know if you can tell now this is the bottom the bottom bundles look like that and then i want to see the middle uh i don't know how to explain it i don't know how to explain it the middle had like um, more defined body wave and then the top and the bottom had um, less defined body wave that's something that I noted and I was kind of like um, why are these two different textures but I guess in the end you can't really tell I mean not by first looking at it all of it just you know goes together very beautifully but you you know if you were looking close at it you or you would have seen it before I put put all of it together you would tell that they were kind of a little bit of different textures I don't know if that bothers anyone for me it bothered me only a little bit but I got over it really quickly because it looks good now like it doesn't it doesn't look too bad for me and and in in any case in the front of my head I always do a little like bump and swoop to the first pieces and that's really the only pieces that I see so I mean, I I changed the curl pattern of the front of the closure anyway, so I guess it was like, you know, you can be mad or you can just deal with it because you're going to change it anyway. So that's one thing that I would note about the hair is kind of like a con. Um, another thing that's really positive about the hair, though, is that it is very, very soft. It is extremely, extremely soft. Um, this hair is like it's very it looks it feels like fresh wash um perms and flat ironed hair that's what it feels like once you can run your, like hair that you can just run your fingers through is so soft baby soft type of hair that's what this hair feels like and i am 110 percent here for that because this hair feels so good feels good on my feel like it's on my face so it feels good on my face it does not feel like sticky or or what's the feeling like heavy or weird on my face, on my skin, on my neck, my back, none of that. It does not feel weird at all. It feels like, it feels good because it's soft. So that is something that I really love about this hair. And along with it being soft, um, there's no tangling and no shedding. 
I have ran my fingers and my brush through this hair. Like, I've, I've really, you know, put this hair to the test. I've been running my fingers through it. And honestly, most of the time, I cannot help it because this hair is so soft. It just leaves me wanting to touch, touch it. But each and every time that I run my fingers through this hair, I get no shedding. Um, I experience like no tangling or anything. This hair has been wet and flat ironed and dried and you know Some stuff and I'm just like I'm still not re experiencing any tangling or any shedding which makes this hair very manageable and very favorable because if it's soft there's no tangling and no shedding and the hair looks bomb what else really can you say what else do you really want from a wig you know what i mean this hair can be flat ironed obviously i told you i put some heat to it i did straighten the piece that was in the back and then um just to like flatten it out i straightened it a little bit or like straighten the top of the hair a little bit to I just flatten it out and then hairspray it to keep a little bit of the flyaways on the closure down. But other than like, with that, I realized that this hair takes heat very well. Um, I did this curl. I did this little curl and I did this. Uh, you cannot tell. It was like a, a little spiral curl on this side. Um and it's still holding up i did this yesterday and the hair is still holding up i did not spray this with a with um hairspray or got to be like i didn't spray it with anything the only thing i sprayed was the top to keep the flyaways down and this hair has still held up the curl and the little swoop that i did to it so that to me screams that this hair is also like what do you call that when you can what is that called when you can manipulate a hair manipulate a hair into a style and it lasts like that's what this hair is um i could have did the little waves all across the hair but really all i had to do is wet the hair and scrunch it up a little bit and let it dry and it dries like when it's wet obviously it looks like thin but when it dries it's super super poofy and just you know like but if you don't like it to be that poofy which i learned because there was a point where this hair was super super poofy i just sprayed a little bit of water on the ends i sprayed a little bit of water on the ends i raised my fingers and then i scrunched it up because that's really where you'll start to see when you work when you work from the ends up you'll start to see that the poofiness goes down um so that's something to note i guess i mean i don't really have that many cons about this hair other than the flyaways at the at the middle of the or at the back of the closure the hair was like like this this long and then the rest of it was like you know the 12 inch 12 inches <sighs> that was like weird i was just like you know but um what else y'all i really don't have that many cons or have I, yeah i don't have that many cons about this hair i mean and honestly this hair is bomb like <laughs> there's not a lot that i can say is like wrong with it i think the ends look really nice they're thick. I think this hair is bomb. What y'all think? In the end, I guess I would just say I really, really like this hair. Like, I feel like I look all look all of that in a bag of chips, to be honest. I have been taking pictures nonstop because this hair just looks so good. And the closure, it came so beautifully. The only thing I had to do was pluck the closure um to make the part a little bit wider but i didn't really need to do that i could just put some concealer right there which is what i did on the back of the closure or 
the bottom side of closure i put some foundation powder right there just where the part is and then i put a little bit right here um better than that i think the hair i think this hair is really amazing i was literally the other day was just like i was like dang like i'm not gonna i was like dang I'm trying to find something I don't like about this hair. Like, I'm trying to find something that's wrong with this hair. It's too good to be true. And my girlfriend was like, why are you trying to do that? Like, if you like the hair, just tell them that you like the hair. And don't be afraid to just share your opinion on that. So, I guess I agree. And I feel like I find th I feel that this hair is truly amazing. And you guys need to go and look up beauty forever hair their link will be down in the description along with more hair details on other hair that they have on their website and direct links to their hair there's also a five percent discount code that they gave to me to leave in the description box um along with all of their contact information and anything else that you may want to know about this hair um, and without further ado, I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.